Hi everybody, Ace of Hearts Fox here, and welcome to another First Suit Friday video. In today's video, we're opening up fan mail! But it's hard to open letters, so I gotta break the magic. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Ugh, I'm so sorry. Our first letter today comes from Baldwin, New York. Dear Ace of Hearts Fox, my name is Kiva Skunk, aka Charlie. I'm a native New Yorker. I'm 19. I just recently found your channel via Debox channel. Oh, that's my old channel. Cool. I loved those vids and I'm somewhat sad to see it go, but your vids are just as funny. Why, thank you. You were the channel to actually get me into the fandom via Animal Crossing and Five Nights at Furries vids. Your suit is adorable too. Why, thank you, Charlie. What is your favorite Kamen Rider and Super Sentai series? Is that the thing kind of like Power Rangers where they like turn into food? I think there's one where they turn into food. That's my favorite. But anyways, question number two. What do you suggest? just for first time suitors, because I want to get a partial suit. As far as a first first suit, it kind of depends. I mean, I kind of went all in and got a more for less suit for my first suit, but if you're just trying out for suiting and don't quite know if you're into it yet, maybe try on someone else's suit or maybe make one for yourself and try it out and see if you like it or not. Either way, there's no wrong way to do it. It's kind of just a matter of what you want to do. What is your favorite suit maker? Hmm. I mean, I'm super biased to more for less because they've made both of my first suits, but I'd have to say my favorite is Kyborg Studios. They are so cool. I know they're not necessarily traditional fursuits, but I mean, they're just so unique and I, I would totally try to commission them someday. Number four, can we be pen pals? Yeah, of course. Our next letter today comes from Andrew Smith in West Virginia. Hello, Ace. How's it going in California? It's pretty good. It's kind of sunny out today. I'm Andrew Smith. I'm a new furry, and I'm a wolf-fox hybrid, and my character's name is Creever. It's like creature, but with a V instead of a T. But anyway, will you be at Anthrocon 2018 this year? If so, I'll be looking forward to talking or hanging or whatever furries do over there for fun. I also hope to get a picture with you at the convention. I hope to be a YouTuber like you one day. Also, please write me back so that I know you got my letter. Also, what's it like for you to be a furry? Because I'm still trying to figure out the whole furry thing. I think it's pretty cool. I mean, basically, you just tie in furry stuff with whatever you already like. I mean, so I already liked messing with video stuff, so I made furry videos. So maybe try taking one of your other hobbies and applying it to furry stuff. I've been working on the money to buy a fursuit, but a lot of the places I know are really high priced. I've been thinking of buying a fursuit off eBay for like $300 because it's cheap, but I don't really know if I should buy it or just keep saving to buy something off of Furby or Made For You or maybe even Beast Cup someday. My personal advice is to be very careful if you ever want to buy a fursuit on eBay because most of the time it's either a scam or it's some kind of knockoff character costume. If you are looking for a decent price on a fursuit though, Furby definitely has some pretty cool auctions sometimes. Also, if you do see me at Anthrocon, feel free to get that picture. Our next letter today comes from Jet the Panther from Allen, Texas. Let's see. Oh, they drew a bean. They drew the boy. They drew that boy. Oh, and they even drew him with a little collar. I gotta start wearing a collar with my suit. They're so cute. They also included a letter, but they asked that I don't read it on camera, and I want to be respectful of that, so I'm gonna go ahead and fold this on up. But I did get your letter, and I'm gonna try to reply to it as soon as I can. Also, thank you so much for the drawing. That's so cute. Our next letter comes from Moonturbia in Columbus, Ohio. Let's see. Oh, wow, there's a couple things in here. Oh, hello. Ah. Ah, oh, first of all, there is a very fancy photograph, look at that, of some art. Oh, then that, that's the actual art. Okay, so they did like, they did like a paper one, and then they did a glossy one. Thank you. I'm going to keep these safe over here. Okay, so let's see. Oh, they also have a letter. Oh, there's like little paw prints in the letter. That's their persona's paw print, and then there's my paw print. Ah. Oh. Hello, Ace of Hearts Fox. My name is Moon Turvia. I hope I'm pronouncing that correctly. Moon Turbia. Moon Turbia. Probably just Moon Turbia. I hope I'm pronouncing that right. Hello, Ace of Hearts Fox. My name is Moon Turbia. I really like your content. It inspires my art all the time, and it helps me relieve my stress. Always happy to help. You have that positive persona, and you are downright funny. Why, thank you. I'm not a big fan of fursuits, but you and your content bring a smile to my face. Sorry for the sloppiness, by the way. I think they're talking about their penmanship, but honestly, that's a, that's about a, how well I write, too. I have a question, though. What was your favorite pastime, like toys or something you used to do? Let's 
see. One of my favorite things is music. I love singing and I love playing guitar, and I used to do that a lot more often, and I'm actually hoping to get back into music, but in the meantime, I just don't have the time for it. But when I used to play shows and live performances, I had a lot of fun with it. P.S. There's a photo and a print of the drawing that I drew by hand for you inside. I hope you like it. Um, I love it. And he describes his persona and leaves his deviant art. Cool. I'll check those out. Thank you. Muntervia. This next letter comes from Marissa Schumacher in Columbus, Ohio. Dear Ace, my name's Marissa. I'm 11 years old and I've been watching your videos for about one and a half years now. Holy moly, you have way better handwriting than I do. What is this? How does an 11 year old write so much better than me? Okay, I'm sorry, I'll continue with the letter, but I just had to point that out. You have incredible penmanship. Dear Ace, my name's Marissa. I'm 11 years old and I've been watching your videos so far for about one and a half years. I live in Ohio. I've been thinking about making my own persona named Ruth. That is an adorable name for a persona. But there's a problem. I don't know if I want her to be a Dutch angel dragon or a wolf, so I was wondering if you had any advice to help me decide. I would appreciate if you wrote back. Also, I love your vids. Stay awesome! I had to do it like that because she said it in all caps. P.S. I also am thinking about joining a group, but there are none around me. At least I don't think. As far as your fursona dilemma, ask yourself why do you want to be a Dutch Angel Dragon or why do you want to be a wolf? I'd say whichever one you have a more emotional attachment to, that's the one I would pick for a fursona. But again, it's all up to you. Also, thanks for the letter. This next letter comes from Portland, Oregon. Dear Ace of Hearts Fox, I'm sorry I can't give you anything. Also, my handwriting and spelling is bad. What do you mean you don't give me anything? You gave me a letter. Also, my handwriting is really bad, so I have nowhere to correct anyone on their handwriting. But thanks for being a big inspiration to me. You're very welcome. I've joined the fandom recently, and do you have any tips for me, like how to clean a fursuit? Typically, after doing things like filming a YouTube video, I'll spot clean my fursuit, but if I go to a convention for a weekend or go to a long event, then I tend to give it a full wash. It kind of just depends on what your materials are and how often you use it. Envelope! We got an envelope! Okay, okay, we're gonna open it up, we're gonna open it up. Oh my gosh, there's a lot of stuff. Okay, first of all, I got a little wood burn me. It's like I can proudly display this over the mantle where the fire goes. Seriously, thank you, I love this. There's some art, and then there's, there's more art, and then there's more art, <laughs> some more art. <laughs> oh, and, and one of them has a letter on it. Okay, okay, okay. <clears throat> Dear Ace of Hearts Fox, I am a big fan of yours. I've been watching your videos for a month now and I get so excited when you put out a new video. Your videos are so amazing, why thank you. I hope to see you at BLFC this year. Yeah, if you see me at BLFC, say hi. By the way, I put 2017 on the woodburn because that's the year you started making videos on this channel. Oh, that's so cool, thank you. Also, I was wondering what your favorite furry movie is. Mine is Zootopia. Mine's Robin Hood, actually. Oh, there's two more things at the bottom here. Oh! He sent me playing cards! I love this! I actually, I like to collect playing cards with like different backs on them and stuff. I don't know, it's cute. Thank you! Well, thank you for the package, Logan. I really appreciate it, and uh, I'll see you at BLFC! Yeah! We got one more thing, you guys. We got one more thing. And it's a big thing. It's a box thing. It's a Germany box thing. It's from Andreas Diedrich. And I'm guessing from Germany, because everything is in German. Oh my gosh, this is a heavy box. I'm gonna set down the box. Oh. First of all, it has... It has a really cute looking letter on here, oh, and then it's got a like, what's in the tube? Ace, here is a drawing I did for you. Hope you like it. I had much fun while I drew it. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. Look at this. I love the way you drew them. This is so cute. Hello, dear Ace of Hearts Fox. First of all, I would like to apologize for my spelling. I never learned English at school, and English isn't my native language. As you may have noticed, the package address is from Germany. So I hope you understand the messages in the letter. I might paraphrase it just a little. I always wanted to send you some fan mail, but life as it is, there was always some sort of other thing that got in the way. But now I finally have the time to do it! Well, I'm glad you made the time! Thank you so much! That, like, that is actually a time-consuming thing to send a package to somebody, so thank you! I want to say a big thanks again for all the videos and positive energy you share with us. You got no idea how often you cheer me up when I have a bad day! Thank you! Also, I guess it's needless to say that you're my favorite furry YouTuber! Well, thank you so much! That means a lot to me, seriously, thank you! Now, all I want to say are the things inside the package. Me and my girlfriend decided to send you a bunch of German 
classic chocolate and sweets and we hope you like it. Also inside the paper roll I put up a drawing for you. Oh yeah, the drawing! I couldn't find a reference sheet of your persona, so I did what I could with your YouTube channel banner. And I hope you can agree with the colors that I didn't do much wrong. Nope, you got it spot on! Oh my gosh, all the German candy, you guys. <gasps> There's all the German candy. Okay, first of all, I keep... Anytime I hear about German candy, I always hear about these gummy bears, so I am so excited to try these. Thank you. And oh my gosh, look at this. Oh my gosh! It's all these different flavored German chocolates! This is so cute! I love this! Oh my gosh, wow, there's like a million flavors. There's Oreo flavor, there's like some sort of cookie flavor thing, and then I don't even know what that says. <laughs> That's another Oreo. I know what Oreos are, no matter if they're German or English, I know what an Oreo is. Okay, I know that one. Hazelnut. Yeah, it's a hazelnut. Yeah, okay, I got that one. Ooh, they got three hazelnut ones. Sorry, I have a huge sweet tooth and I love this. Thank you. There's also these, whatever these are. Duplo. Schmeckt. Knoopers. Liked. Yeah! Seriously, thank you so much for the package. I really appreciate it. And I'm hoping to get to Euroference this year. So if you see me there, say hi. Oh my gosh, we had so much mail this time around, you guys. This was so cool. Thank you all so much to everyone who sent in your letters. And I'm going to try to reply to everything as soon as I can. It's just a matter of taking the time to write all these letters. Because I want to make sure that all of them are personal. But anyways, if you guys want to be featured in the next fan mail video, you can go ahead and send a letter or a package to the P.O. Box right here. Also, if you enjoyed this video, go ahead and hit like and subscribe down below for new videos every week. Also, I want to thank these lovely supporters from Patreon for producing today's video. And I want to thank these beautiful people for sponsoring today's video. Well, that's all I got for you guys today. Thanks again for watching, everybody. My name's Ace of Hearts Fox, and I will see you all in the next video. Psh